Hi, welcome to MacLeod. And this is John again. And uh, I would like you to present to you this another uh, printing in action of a uh, MP MacLeod MP seventeen hundred. And so here we okay we made a print already. So that's the roll printing. See, you can see there's a lot of print already there. So now I uh, make it cut and uh, cut already. So this is what we're gonna do. We will cut this one now. The one that the most important that I would like you to do is like after you print it, you finish cut. So you cut it. Okay. So after you cut it, this is your transfer now, okay? So we will put it here. Okay. Oh, don't move there. Okay. Then after that, all you have to do now is put the finish. So when you press the word finish here, the whole film now will start to eject back. It's not ejecting. It's like it goes back to printing position again. And now you just need to roll this like this. Okay. And it will print again. Now you're ready to print for the second time. Okay. So one thing that you should, uh, so you have to wait while printing. You have to be careful because like this, I cut uh, one here while this one is on print. So what happened? So I smear it. So you see the smear? Because I cannot wait. So that's why when you cut it, be sure that you are in, you are in the right, you have to wait a little bit to make it longer so that it will not affect the printer. So that's the only way to, to a reminder that when you cut, you have to be very, very careful not to move the, the film because or else you it will have a smear like this okay but uh, this is a very versatile and uh, fast production for printing because you know you can print it in roll and this is all original this one is original Epson the roll feeder and everything here the good thing with this MP1700 is it has a built-in uh, roll so here you can cut and eject so you need to cut this one, I'll show it to you. So you have to cut, cut and eject. So let's say when you say cut, say this is how it works. Cut and eject is, cut and eject. So when you say cut, he will print the cut and he will forward the, the, the film. So the film is here already. Okay. So once you've done it, all you have to do is, I think it prints something here. Because it's white, you cannot see it. So, but you have to watch it. So the cut is here. So the white is here. Did you see it? The white? You see my hands? That's the white. So all you have to do is cut from here. Okay. After you cut that, you finish, please finish. This one, finish here. And the roll, this one, it will go back to the printing position. So that's the beauty of this printer. Uh, paper is poly, won't tighten paper. Okay, so he said to have to tighten the paper. Yeah, so you have to, oops. Yeah, so the whole thing was out. It was ejected. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so that's it. So that this is how the printer works. This is the beauty of this printer. That's why it's so expensive. It has 17 inch, so you can print uh, diagonal. But this one, I'm using a 12 inch right now. So I'm printing uh, in portrait. Okay, so you can use this one. You can use a 12 inch roll. There's a 13 inch roll, and there is a 17 inch roll. So... This is very versatile for everything. Unlike the small printer, the 13 inch we had, you cannot you cannot put a 17. So this one is all everything. 17, 13, and 12. That's all the roll that is available at MacLeod. 
and you have to fit it with uh, McLeod rubberized rubberized uh, powder or adhesive so this one are really good this one are really good see the adhesive this is rubberized okay and we have white and we have black so these are the black see these are the black this is the McLeod and this is the black black powder this is all rubberized this is a game changer when you put rubberized the feel is like a, a vinyl so it's really like a vinyl and it has a self-healing characteristic so when you stretch it like in the polyester when you wash it with a and dry it with a, a little bit of heat it will return back together with the fabric so unlike the other powder when you stretch it it will break this one it will not break it will stretch so it's stretchable the, the adhesive that we have right now is stretchable so we're the only one who has it right now so because McLeod is a leader in DTF so look at this this is a good one okay so this one is ready for powdering so I like you to this printer this is a little bit of expensive but this is worth this is like you know I told you 17 13 and 12 you can print anything and it has all the necessary things for roll printing and yeah it's really cheap so I try to compute it if you use the 12 inch 328 feet long and you can print like per linear put will cost you like 60 cents only so your cost of transfer here about 60 cents to 75 cents if you are using this one so this is the best way now think about it 75 cents per 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 design more or less or a dollar that is your cost plus the shirt which is a dollar fifty maybe or two dollars or two fifty so that's your cost of the shirt is three dollars and you sell that shirt for twenty to thirty five dollars and this is when with this kind of design look at this design it's really good see i'll cut it oh, oh. oh yes. So look at up. Oh, oh, that's this story. Okay? So look at this design. It's really good. Okay. So this is next for ready for ready for powdering. Yeah. So so see you next time and happy new year.